Okay, we have this Asus, all of a sudden it turns on and nothing happens. So that's the issue here, you can see the backlight is on. And nothing on the screen, caps lock not working, charge is fine. The user said they turned the, this happened before. They simply hold the power button for 40 seconds, shut it down and try to boot again and it will work. But they try to do that again, it will not work. So let's see if it's something simple or anal. Let's see. Painful. That's what I meant. Okay. That is so strange. So those two are tiny ones, okay. Oh, second. Oh, yeah, give me one sec. Yeah, good, thank you. Okay, so first thing we shall do, disconnect battery. Does this have a CMOS battery? Looks like Asus has stopped that for a while. Okay, power. Disconnect power, power cycle. Nothing yet. May need to wait for the BIOS reset maybe. Let's wait a little bit more. Try a different RAM. I don't know why I put two RAM. I can I can also just put one. We'll get external screen hooked up to. I'm going to turn it off. Alright, let's turn it back on. The user did mention that screen went uh, pixelated. Oh, is it doing a reboot? It is, okay, good. Oh, 
Okay, then it should come up now. So that's the second time. There we go, we got it through, we got internal screen. Yep, we're in the system. Shut down. Okay, it has properly shut down. The pixelated screen can relate to RAM if, the, if, if, if it was using a RAM GPU. Uh, RAM, that's the memory for the GPU, internal GPU. So, quick mem test if you can. Yeah, it is not booting now. Same thing. Okay. All right, we suspect it is the RAM. Okay, so not booting. That's a one RAM only. Yep, okay. Now Let's put this RAM, working RAM in, oh, out and put the other RAM in. And it works. Go figure. Put this RAM in back okay so we do know that when the keyboard doesn't do flickering rainbow lights flickering rainbow lights meaning it's passed the self-test it's locked up now okay That's very interesting, huh? I'm going to put a 16 gigabyte single module. Sodium 2, Sodium 1. Mosquito, FU. No. That slot is funny. It's something to do with the UDIM one. Put that in here. Here we go, rainbow light, see? Oh, no, not really, okay. 
that just does that in the beginning. Yeah, but this one did boot, okay. Do a quick men test using our RAM. Seven boot security secure boot disable boot save and change to exit It's more like the first port is kind of funny. And I don't think these RAMs are actually faulty as well. No, that's faulty. No, that's fine. But you know, we put two thirty two sixteen gigs. That worked. Yeah, the memory chips are playing up. They're funny. I don't think it supports itself. Okay, if this test doesn't produce any faults, then that will be the end. So for now, thanks for watching. If you get any faults, I'll come back to the video. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one.